welcome to this video lecture series on analysis and design of algorithms in this session i shall explain heap sort i'll make this session very simple and short i am going to give you briefly the details about the heap sort and explain with an example here i have taken an array here with the uh, five elements which has to get sorted heap sort algorithm is based on the data structure called heap and you will be using the heapify method in order to sort the elements now heapify method is what heapify method is to convert a binary tree that means you are rearranging the elements of the binary tree into min heap or max heap so now you will be coming across two more terms one is the min heap and another is the max heap and what is the difference between these two in min heap the parent node is always having a value lesser than the children node okay and in uh, max heap the parent node is having a value greater than the children node so all the details you will be knowing once I explain you with an example here what exactly is the process here to sort the elements given are these five elements if it is not mentioned as ascending or descending you will be sorting the elements in the ascending order only the output will be what if you are sorting in the ascending order it is 3, 5, 7, 10, 11 this is the very first step is you will form a binary tree so just take the first element 5 right here okay that becomes the first node then you have the next element 7 you will place it towards the left side then 11 then 10 and 3 so just simply place all the elements one by one in the form of a binary tree once you do this you have to now convert this into a heap to convert it into a heap you have to use the process heapify you have two options here either you can convert it into min heap or max heap so i am doing here with min heap let me write first as it is start from the leaf level okay here you have elements 10 and 3 if you compare this with the parent node parent node is 7 so min heap says that the parent node should always have a value lesser than the children nodes but, but now it is greater than 3 so what you have to do in the first step is you need to swap here so you swap these elements you will get now 3 will come in the place of 7 and now we are here in this level we have the elements 3 and 11 in this level and the parent node is what 5 so once again if you see here this parent node is what greater than the child node so you have to swap now check whether this is a min heap first level you just check parent node is 3 which is lesser than 5 and 11 next level is 5 5 is lesser than 10 and 7 so this way you have constructed here the min heap now one more operation you need to carry out in the heap sort delete the root node so when you try to delete this node delete 3 that means the parent node the root node needs to get deleted here the i'll place the deleted element here the first element which i am deleting is 3 see once you delete 3 then this place becomes vacant here fine if it becomes vacant then which element are you going to put there the element at the leaf level you need to put there see at the leaf level we have 10 and 7 two nodes are there which one will you select you need to select always from the right side so 7 is the element which will come to this place you will delete 3 and you will bring 7 here in the place of 3 now you check your binary tree is having four elements one element is deleted and you have stored here it is 3 next once again you just check whether 5 is less than 11 perfect no problem then next go to the next level it is 7 here 7 is greater than here 7 is greater than 5 see 7 is less than 12 no problem this child node but one more child node is having a value 5 and the parent node is 7 so 7 is greater than 5 then you have to swap it after you swap this now the root element is what 5 so you have to delete that so i'll delete it and place it here now if once you delete this, this position becomes vacant then which element are you going to place there the leaf node the leaf node we have only one node here 10 so 10 will come to this place so now your tree is having only three elements see the parent node is having a value greater than the child node 11 no problem it is greater than 10 but 7 is what less than 10 so that means the parent node 10 is greater than 7 then if that is the case you need to swap so this procedure is called as heapify root node get deleted now so delete 7 i'll add here to this list i have deleted 7 
once you delete 7 the place is vacant here so which element will you bring you have one node this side 10 and another is 11 always as the procedure says you have to select leaf node from the right side rightmost leaf node has to be selected now check whether the parent node is having a lesser value than the child node no it is not having lesser value so you need to swap it now the root node is 10 which will get deleted so we will delete that and place it here the only element remaining in the tree will be 11 finally that also get added to the list see the output is what 3 5 7 10 11 the, ele the elements have got sorted here i have mentioned few points about the heap sort algorithm in the introduction as i said it is a sorting algorithm which is used to arrange a list of elements in order and in order to sort this you are using the tree concept so that means this algorithm uses the tree concept called as heap tree and also in the introduction i told you about the max heap and min heap so you can always create a max heap or you can create a min heap max heap can be used to arrange list of elements in the descending order min heap can be used to arrange list of elements in the ascending order and here i have written the same steps here step by step process for arranging the elements in the ascending order first step whatever we carried out in that example same steps i have written here construct first step is what construct a binary tree with a given list of elements then you are going to convert that binary tree into min heap then you will delete the root element from the min heap using the heapify method then you are as and when you are deleting you will put that elements into the sorted list then you will repeat the same until the min heap becomes empty display the sorted list summary is also again here heap tree you are using so this algorithm makes use of the data structure called heap tree and in order to sort the elements you need to either form a max heap or a min heap in max heap the parent node will be greater than the child node and min heap the parent node will be less than the child node what do you mean by almost complete binary tree suppose when you start constructing the tree you start with the root node and then so if you are placing the next element here and suppose if you place immediately here this is not correct okay the reason is this is this you cannot call it as almost complete binary tree almost complete binary tree says that at every level you fill the elements so here we require two elements so definitely what we will do is first we will place the left node and then next to the right node so this level gets filled up then only you move to the next level here okay and then once again you have to fill the first left node and then the right node then we don't go to this step now because still you have to complete this right side of the node then you will go to this node and then you will go to this node now coming to the time efficiency for this algorithm actually in this algorithm there are two main operations that are being carried out one main operation is to construct the heap the time taken to construct the heap for n elements will be n the second main operation is about the deletion so the time taken to delete the element is log n time taken to delete n elements will be n log n the total time will be n plus n log n you need to take the higher value term so you can write down here the time efficiency for this algorithm is theta into n log n theta n log n is the time complexity for all the cases best case average case and worst case so that's all in this session please like share and subscribe to my channel thank you bye bye and take care